B-Lock Compression Hub Installation Instructions. Make sure that the locking device, tapers, shaft and your component's contact areas are clean and lightly oiled. Installation Loosen and remove all locking screws. Grasping the front outer ring, lift the front outer ring and front inner ring off the assembly. Add your component to the assembly by aligning the bore of your component with the pilot surface of the rear outer ring. Place the front outer ring and the front inner ring on the assembly by aligning your component's bore with the pilot surface. Rotate the front inner ring until the slit is aligned with the slit in the rear inner ring. Then insert the locking screws through the clearance holes in the front inner ring. Thread the screws into the corresponding holes in the rear inner ring. Hand tighten each screw and confirm that the faces of your component are flush with the contacting face of the outer rings. Set a torque wrench to approximately 5% higher than the specified installation torque. Using only 90 degree quarter turns, tighten the locking screws in either a clockwise or counterclockwise sequence. Continue tightening until the torque wrench clicks on each screw before a quarter turn can be achieved. Continue to apply 5% over torque for one or two more passes. Reset the torque wrench to the specified torque and check all locking screws. No screw should turn at this point. If a screw moves, repeat the over torque process. Removal. Check to ensure that axial movement of clamp collars and your component are not restricted. Loosen all locking screws in sequence by quarter turns until screws can be turned by hand. Loosen by hand for several more turns. Remove completely two locking screws that are approximately 180 degrees apart. Transfer these screws into the push-off threads of the front inner ring. Please note that all other locking screws should be left in place. Release the assembly by progressively tightening the two push-off screws using quarter turns.